Hey guys, it's Lindsay, and in today's video, I want to show you a quick and simple trick to tracing any text or design onto a cookie without a projector. So let's get started. For this trick, you'll need your cookies already cut out and baked, and in this case, already iced. Um, you'll also need some sort of printout of your design or your text. I just printed it out on a piece of paper. Um, you will want to make sure that it's in the right size. Um, you'll also need some tissue paper, like a gift wrap paper, and then some sort of food marker. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take your printout of your design or your text and you're going to put the tissue paper over top. It doesn't matter which side of the tissue paper you're writing on. Sometimes they have a little shine to them. It doesn't really matter. And then you're going to take your food marker and you're just going to outline the text or design. Since this text is really kind of bubbly and big, I'm just going over the outline. It doesn't need to be the entire text. Then you'll take your tissue paper and you'll place it onto your cookie, make sure that it's aligned properly and it's in the center or wherever you want it. And then you're gonna go back over that tracing with your pen one more time. One thing I would recommend is, I'm using a black marker here. I would recommend trying to use a marker similar to the icing color you're gonna place on top. Black will run into the icing, whatever color it is. So if you're using a light icing, use a lighter color marker. Now you have your tracing onto the cookie and you can easily go over it with your icing. So I'm going over it with a piping consistency pink icing. I like to use piping consistency icing when um, doing any sort of text because it makes a really big puffy letter and it's also much easier to control and won't run all over the place and ruin the design or the shape of your text. I like to use a scribe tool to get rid of any bumps or ridges and make sure that the text is perfect. and then continue outlining and filling in every letter until the text is complete. If you want to learn more about writing on cookies, I have a whole video and blog post dedicated to that topic, so I will link that at the end of this video. And this trick works on any type of text, including a handwritten font like this one here. Um, I'm just doing the same process, tracing it over onto a piece of tissue paper and then putting that on top of a cookie. My only piece of advice is make sure that the icing you're using is thicker than the width of this line in the font um, because you are going to want to cover over the entire line that you've created on the cookie. I hope you found this little trick helpful and now you know how to trace onto a cookie without a projector. And of course, if you want to see more cookie decorating videos like this, hit subscribe below.